As booster shots are becoming the norm, Western Michigan University is taking action to incorporate them into their health and safety protocols. You say David Horak lays out the details for us, including when these changes will take place. Well, with students and staff returning, Western Michigan University is starting the new year and the new semester with a change in how they're protecting those on campus against COVID's newest variants. But continually looking at our safety protocols uh, to make sure that we're doing as much as we possibly can to limit the spread of COVID-19 on our campus. Beginning January 17th, Western's definition of being fully vaccinated against COVID for students, faculty, and staff will be included to include a booster shot. University President Dr. Edward Montgomery explains the decision came from the school's COVID task force, consistently looking at local conditions and guidelines from both the state and federal agencies. The onset uh, and the growth of Omicron uh, and the recommendations from the CDC and uh, other levels of government for the booster would make it prudent for us to take that step as well and add that layer of protection. But with more than 81 percent of students and staff already having their soon to be initial dosage, Montgomery is confident this addition to their protocol helps keep the university's positivity rate below three percent. This is but a Another layer that we're adding in response to uh, changes in uh, the nature of uh, COVID-19. Now, this change does not affect anyone who chose to test regularly instead of getting their vaccine. Staff who are already in the university's said protocol began theirs this week. Students required to do so will continue theirs next week. Inside our Kalamazoo studio, David Horak, News 8.